Yo, it's your boy HP at the source, Harry Pinero. Yes, I'm back with another video on my channel. A big thank you to everyone that's helped me get to 500k subscribers. Well, we can get to a million, can we? Of course we can. And I need your help. So guys, please, before the video even starts, just please subscribe. It's just a click of a button. All you gotta do is just press the button. Like, it's not hard. When I watch other people's videos, I subscribe. I just want a gold plaque, man. Allow me, man. Oh. Yes, I've got my We Are Winning t-shirts. The merch will be available for you guys. We are, we are, we are, we are, we are winning. Yes, it will. Um, let me know in the comments if you like the way it looks. If it's a bit of you, let me know in the comments. And um, yeah, it will be available very, very shortly. Now, guys, there was a roast. Not just any roast. I ain't talking about a Sunday dinner one. We're talking about the biggest roast in the country. Sidemen roast. Now, I was asked by JJ, yes, KSI, and also Toby Jizzle. So only the black members in the group actually asked me to be part of it. My brothers, I'm with you. However, you know, wrote my jokes. I had everything prepared, everything. I was gonna, yo, I was gonna tell Zerka that nobody likes his content. I was gonna tell, you know, Vix that, listen, bro, the only reason why you got a, a nice looking woman in your life is because you have money. I was gonna say all of those things, but however, being a father, your son, or your daughter always comes first. I had an emergency, which I had to attend to. So I wasn't able to make it, even though I was mentioned uh, quite a lot in the video. Obviously they needed me to boost the views and stuff. But anyway, um, so I said to myself, you know what? Before I react to this video, what I'm going to do is speak to you guys and ask you guys, you know what, roast me. So I put on my social media, I said, listen guys, roast me, the best ones will make it to the video. And that's exactly what's gonna happen. Now I haven't seen these. Hopefully you look as nice to me. So yeah, I'm just gonna, re I'm just gonna react to them. Let's get into it. World War ended on your 10th birthday. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, do you know what? Um, you probably left your hairline on Noah's Ark. Yeah, hey. No, and they don't say jokes, I love you. What is it? Are you an enemy or are you my peoples? Because I, I, I don't know the difference. But anyway, gonna let that one slide. You're so old, you went to school before they had a history class. Mm. Woo. Yeah, that's, that's, that's actually a good joke. You know what, fair play to you. Harry is so old, you know, that he was there when Mary gave birth to Jesus. Do I actually look that old? Like, really? Do I look old? Because I don't think I do. I'm not saying you're going bold, but you'll find Waldo before you find... Okay, okay, cool. Okay, cool, I'll take that. Your forehead is the size of a helipad. Love you, bro, don't take it to heart. Like, do you see what I'm trying to say? That's like slapping me and saying, hope, oh, it's okay. It doesn't hurt. It's your illusion. You just said that a helicopter can land on my forehead. Like, come on. <laughs> it's not that big. Your hairline looks like a McDonald's billboard joke. Love your content. Ah, I wanna. All this McDonald's talk, they still haven't sponsored me. Like, I have done work with them. Thank you for that. And, and the premise of it was because of my hairline, which was cool. Man said he's trying to up his fashion game and hopped out in a grizzly bear jumper. All right, guys, we're gonna put the post here of how I looked and let me know. Was it a bad fashion choice? Was it a good one? It was Marnie. If those that know what Marnie is, that's a decent, you know, brand. So I, I feel like I did well. I'm not gonna lie. It did itch me a lot, but cool. Harry looks like the A-level darkest. Is that a roast? Is that a diss? Is that a diss? Let me know if that's a diss, because if, if that's a diss, um, Yomi, uh, suck your mum. It's nearly been a year since Ramadan, and your hairline is still busted. Hi, yay, yay. Hi, yay, yay. Well, guess what? Your breath is thinking. Your hairline is so far back, even Rosa Parks refused to sit there now. All those roasts got me feeling a bit hot, and he's starting to cool me down. With that being said, this video is sponsored by Air Up. Yes, you're probably wondering what Air Up is. Well, this is the next level, the new level, the best level of hydration. Now, as you can see, obviously, this is just filled with normal water. Now, these pods change the flavor of the water. And we have, you know, for example, tangerine. We have wild berry, cherry cola, raspberry and lemon. Now, it's very simple. As you can see, you got the Air Up bottle in my hand with just water in it. Now, if you want to add some flavor to it, I'm going to use this pod. This is the watermelon pod. So I'm going to literally place it in here still normal water. That's just because I haven't lifted up the pod. Lift up the pod. And there's the flavors that I was looking for. You know what it is? If I'm being deadly serious, yeah? It's down to the flavor, really. Whatever flavor you like. I like watermelon. I do like cherry cola. And I do love tangerine as well. So it's dependent on the flavor for you. Go check it out, guys. It's really, really good. Especially if you're trying to train and in the gym and you want something different. And water's obviously very healthy for you. This doesn't change that. It actually adds to it as well because it tastes 
splendid and obviously the link will be in there for you to go and cop it it's very very good affordable as well and obviously it comes in different color i've got a steel one now this one i'm going to keep at home this one's for the gym just in case i lose it I, i'd rather have this one because it's cold it's, it's amazing well anyway, guys i know what you're here for it's time for me to react to the side man all right let's go and simon off camera you still have no friends <laughs> <laughs> Global superstar KSI still hanging around with these gimps. <laughs> KSI, as we know, stands for knowledge, strength, and I've never hugged my dad. Oh, <laughs> no, no, Calux, Calux. All right, can I be honest with you, yeah? I hosted the premiere for um, KSI's documentary on, on, on Prime Video, which is really, really good. You should go watch that, yeah? And everyone was very emotional. It hasn't been two weeks since it's out. And Calyx, is this what you're on? You are a ruthless man. But I like the LV jacket, though. Ooh, you're getting a lot of that. <laughs> <laughs> Look, he's fucking his dog as well. Hey, that's cold. <laughs> that's cold. Uh, anyway, uh, Harry De Niro, is he here? <laughs> nah, he didn't uh, make he it. He backed out? Yeah. Uh, I was going to say that um, it's good that he came here on his own today. Congratulations, he finally managed to step out of Chunks his shadow. Oh. Evidently not. <laughs> Calux! Calux, what do you mean? <laughs> Calux! What do you mean? Look at Billy the Goat and, and Big Zoo, they're laughing at me. I had an emotional one of him talking about leukemia and everything. And this is how you do me. Wow, brother. Not too long ago, JJ dodged the kiss from Astrid Wet at a press conference. If only he was as good at dodging his dad's belt as a kid. Oh! No! no Becky! Wow! Wow! Now, I thought my jokes were going to be bad, but yo! Toby is a religious man. Right, can I just say, yeah? Out of everybody that I watch on YouTube, the person who, for me, is effortlessly funny, dry humour, old-school British humour, Stephen tries. He is the GOAT. Like... Yeah, that's, that's Scarra, and I mean that with all my chest. The only thing holier than him is the pillow he fucks each night. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take it over for the juice, bro. <laughs> when people go for penis enlargements, they hold up a picture of Toby's nose. <laughs> oh! Oh! <laughs> nah. <laughs> nah. Nah, I, I don't have no words to say, but you told Toby. That is a long nose, I'm, I'm being honest. <laughs> <laughs> I'm being honest. Oh, <laughs> no, 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 it's not like this. <laughs> oh, that is so funny. That is so funny. Simon has a kid's charity called MM7, or as Vic pronounces it, mm, seven. <laughs> Hey, hey, Steven, you're the GOAT, bro. You're the GOAT. <laughs> now, Harry's the baby of the group, which is why JJ's so key to get rid of him. <laughs> oh. 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 Harry is from Guernsey. Uh, it's the only place in the world where the most popular dating app is the family WhatsApp group. <laughs> <laughs> Zerka, you look like a rescue human. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. That is mad. That's crazy. <laughs> no, I'll be honest with you. If I don't know the homeboy's name, I'm a fan now. I'm a fan now. Listen, guys, that's all I have time for today. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. You know, thank you for roasting me, guys, and understanding why I wasn't part of the Sad Men roast. I will be there next time. Literally got a son, so very difficult to avoid that. Also, guys, this was an incredible video. Some of the roasts were impeccable. Um, next time, they definitely will have me and Darkest Man there. Maybe as a duo, who knows? Um, but listen, guys, let me know what you feel like I could do better in my videos. Honestly, your responses and, and, and you know, reactions to my videos, they literally help me. So thank you so much, guys. And I hope I can be consistent. We've got another video coming up soon. I'm going to tease it. Someone that shouts, yeah. Someone that cusses a lot. Someone who lost a lot of weight and does a lot of stuff. Peace out. Oh, yeah. Before you... We are winning, match. We are, we are, we are, we are winning. Make sure you're going to get it.